Yet again, we are shaking our heads at the IRS. Here's the latest outrage. 2,800 IRS workers facing disciplinary action were still paid more than $2.5 million in bonuses last year. $1 million of that total was paid to IRS employees who owed back taxes. They hadn't paid the taxes they were collecting. You add this all up. Intimidation of conservatives, lowest learner won't answer questions, four billion paid out in fraudulent refund claims in one year, and these are the people who took us, took us, for a record $1.4 trillion in the last six months. Mary Kissel is smiling. She's from the Wall Street Journal. Come on, Mary. You can't rein these people in. You can't. There's no accountability. Oh, it's so here. incompetent. You almost have to laugh at it. And I'd also add the $11 billion annually that is lost in earned income tax credit fraud. Hold on I mean, a second. The earned income tax credit, that's where you don't earn enough money to pay any tax, but you get a big tax refund anyway. That's in, right. You're saying 11 billion in fraud there? Yeah, this is this is effectively the size of, say, the Commerce Department's budget in a year. So, look, when you add it all up, Stuart, this is an agency that needs a serious, serious overhaul. And they're not getting it. No, There's not no under this administration. The executive branch is not cracking down on them. Period. No, and you have to wonder if this is going on, and your, the 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 Inspector General is finding this kind of fraud in this agency. What's going on across the federal government? A uh, very good question. Sandra, you, you can't fight the tax man, but there's no accountability. There's no accountability. And I looked back at the 2012 numbers. The agency awarded $86.3 million in cash bonuses, almost 490,000 hours of time off, about 70% of the entire IRS agency uh, employees receive some kind of bonus. What company can you say that about in 2012? I mean, this is unbelievable, the lack of accountability. And bottom line, it just sends a horrible message to those in America that are working hard, paying their taxes, to see numbers like that. Well, it, it seems to me that the IRS has become an arm of the administration for political purposes. Maybe I'm going a bit far, Mary. What do you say? Well, it, I read the IRS response to this report, which was absolutely stunning. It's, it's posted up on Treasury's website. They said, well, you know what? Only one federal agency prohibits paying bonuses to people who have had disciplinary action recently taken against them. But you know what? You're right. Maybe we should do something about this. It's just incredible arrogance, Stuart.